Kids Off Rock here. Let's play GeoGuessr. It is Thursday, which means it's time for the Diverse World. We are back on track. This is number nine in the league out of like 56 million or something, however many he has in his, his league series. Um, so we're going to play. And in chat, if you're watching on Twitch, which you would know this already, and if you're not watching on Twitch, you should be. We're in the United States. Um, Shaney and Joseph Street. Cool. We've been talking about uh, one of Sagittarius's uh, coins for sale on the Coins for Sale subreddit, and he's selling Buffalo Nickels. And so it's Buffalo, 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 Buffalo is the title. That is a that is a proper sentence, too, by the way. Ooh, construction, what's up? What was that? That was actually a National Parks thing. I probably should read that. Or at least it looked like a National Parks thing. Oh, it's not. Oh, no, but it's a distinctive adopt a highway sign. How dare I not remember? Uh, shoot. That's very distinctive. My diopter? Of uh, my glasses? Are you, are you asking for my prescription right now? Like, I could tell you. I happen to know that offhand because it's awful. Like, real bad. Legally blind. Legitimately legally blind. What trail is that? Appalachian? Appomatic? Hamtramck? Damn it. Uh, so, my vision is just god-awful. Uh, I have an astigmatism. On the right eye is 165, and I think the axis on the left is one. No, no, the other way. The axis on the left is 165, and the axis on the right is 175. Um, and then I am 9.5 diopters to the negative in the left eye and 8.5 in the right eye. State police, that's distinctive. Jesus, there's so many good clues here that I just don't know. That's embarrassing. That's New York, that is. All right. New York it is. What lake? Topper Lake? Tupper Lake. We're at Tupper Lake. In New York. Upstate. Adirondack. It's got to be the Adirondack Trail. The Rockette River Drive. And kick and two and kick. Different roquette, you think? Nefarious nerd at what is up? How are you doing, Neppy? How's your quest for a new PC? Have you have you embarked on that yet? I tell you, you guys should go check out Neffy because you really should. But uh, she can't stream right now. The computer is kaput, basically. So hopefully you can get that all squared away. Doing well, thank you. Next to Wearly. <laughs> You're awful. I like it, but you're awful. Um. All I know is I'm in upstate New York. It would appears to be a state park, based on the signage. Quest in September. Wow, that's quite some time. Well, if you guys like really, uh, really nice streaming with some entertaining content. You can catch actually Nephi when, uh, on Wednesdays um, after me, of course. Like watch my stream first, but uh, <laughs> she streams with Boone usually playing Two Crowns, uh, Kingdoms Two Crowns. It's really it's it's uh, it's a good time. I highly recommend it. But head on over to her channel and do some things. The Rod Top Inn. I only have 90 seconds. This is really frustrating. And I'm in upstate New York on a lake, right? That's not difficult. <laughs> so many lakes in upstate New York. I should have went the other way. I'm thinking. But now, now I feel committed. Look, this is a giant lake. Maybe if I'm lucky, I can find Tupper Lake. Do, do, do. I can find Tupperware Lake. All right. Uh, do, do, do. Upstate New York. Upstate, they think you're crooked. Scholar Seed was up. Oh my god, I found it. I don't know how, but I found it. Run for it, Marty. It's not where we are, obviously. But there's Raquette Pond. There's Raquette River. We're along this thing. Almost guaranteed we're along this thing. There's Raquette River Drive. We were north of this. Dude, and how did I not see the ice cream shop first off? We're at the corner of who knows what. We're That's right. We're at Shaney and Joseph. We're in the town up here. There's Joseph Street. There's Shaney. Give me some points. Let's go. Let's nail this diverse world today. We aren't joking. Although the current leader was closer than me. That doesn't matter because the tiebreaker is not even distance. <laughs> uh, 
But that's like a tennis racket. Oh, okay. There were road markers and town signs almost immediately. Of course there were. <laughs> Have you not seen the stream before? <laughs> Have you not watched the videos? If there are good clues, I... Thanks for the reset, by the way. I don't think I said that like 85 years ago. Now we are in Argentina. Remember when we thought we were in Argentina and found an Argentinian flag and then we were in Argentina? I think we're in Argentina again. Well, this could be Chile. That's a nice mural. Nicely done with signed, tagged Amor. Manuel Galicio, Escuela de Casosen, Basica Fisco. It's a financial education place. I like it. That's what I'm going back to school for. Calle Colombi. Escuela de Formación de Policías. Centro de la Ciudad, Puente Negro, Monumento de San Pedro, Capilla San Francisco. All these are very good things. Okay, some 8 o'clock concert. This could be almost any South American country, by the way. Or is the sun? Ooh, sneaky. This is actually, I think this is Mexico. Yeah. It could be Spain itself, but it feels American, not European. So I'm going to go with Mexico on this one, which means we're probably in the Mexico City Valley, if I had to guess. And I don't think there's a lot of street viewing in the Yucatan. They have the crosswalks in Argentina. I don't know. I've been here a bunch of times. It's your neck of the woods. Excuse me? New York, probably. AMD Ryzen 5, 1600. What is the X470? Like, is that a Radeon thing? Columbia? No. Maybe. I guess that is the, the northern part of the northern hemisphere. Maybe. I will not discount that. It seems out of place for it to be on Columbia Street in Columbia. But maybe that means we're in... Um, this, um, uh, Jesus... E, E. Help, help. It starts with an E. Guayaquil. Guayaquil is a big city. Guayaquil is a big city where, though? I don't remember. It's in, um, yeah, Ecuador. That's the one I was thinking of. E. It starts with an E. Where the hell is E? So we're in Ecuador. Okay. So what city are we in Ecuador? Igua. Where is Igua? First off, get some points. I know that's not where we are, but at least I'll have some points if I forget to do something in the next two, uh, two minutes and a half. I was about to get debated, but I found it. Let's go. I do remember some things. Like, Guayaquil is a huge city. It also helps that my wife and I, or uh, Ecuador is on the list of things that we want to visit, places we want to go. Uh, we want to go to Quito, not, not Guayaquil, but... Um, the idea is to go to Quito for a couple of nights because it's super cheap. Ecuador is so affordable. And they're on the dollar, which makes traveling as an American very, very easy because it's the literally the same dollar. Uh, but you go to Quito, and then you could take it like a two-night sojourn to the Galapagos, which is what we would do. So it's like a, a short flight and then a boat, I think, to get to the Galapagos Islands from Quito. And it is so cheap. You literally keep your hotel room in Quito the entire time. So you only take like what you need for that one or two nights onto uh, to Galapagos, so it doesn't cost you a lot of money. What city is this, man? It might be Igua. Is Alausi a province or something? Parque Nino, Monumento de San Pedro. What city is this? Like, if we could just get the city, do you know how amazing this would be? Maybe it's Alausi. Uh, Ecuador. Look at that. Is there an Alausi? I mean, we're up in this in the mountains, right? Oh my god, there is. Let's do this. Okay, how close can we get? We're on uh, Colombia. Right, right, right. We're on the Calle Colombia. Uh, where are the street names? Excuse me? Uh, I ordered some street names. I think this road is... No, the Sierra... In Panamerica. Timbebungo. Where is Colombia? 
We're not in the town. Like, we were outside of town. Like, we're up by... This, there was a stadium? Ooh, was there a stadium? First off, it's a north-south... Better set up than your PC. 1100 bucks? That's not bad. What? I'm sorry, what? Oh, that's cold. That is ice cold. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hold please, there's a bug and I gotta go squish. This is probably what my, my cat was seeing if you're watching on Twitch. One moment. One of those damn not ladybug ladybugs. Or not lady like you know what I mean. It was an imposter ladybug. <clears throat> they are not allowed to live in this household. I know it's so close. Come on, man. Cyber power is the case. What case do I have? A Corsair, right? Yeah, I've got a Corsair case. Because I, I wanted to maybe be able to water cool it. So I can use this case when I go up to the Threadripper, which is what I'm going to do. That's my next computer, is to get a Ryzen Threadripper. But I don't need every piece. So I'm just going to get the Threadripper, the motherboard, and uh, the RAM. So it's going to cost me about $1,000, too. Because I already have a, a, a 1070, so I don't I don't really need... I guess I could get a 1080. If you're going to go for a Threadripper, you should get the 1080. But that's going to be, like, much later. This is cool. Peace, love, unity. Keda marked monument. So it's the Keda marked monument. Super marked. Where is this? This kind of looks like Africa, doesn't it? Slices of life. Super loaf. Dude, that loaf is super fine. I need a little monument going on over here. The Baringo County Government. Okay. Is that the Ghanaian flag? It looks like the Ghanaian flag upside down. But we're in Baringo County. Is this Kenya? Are we being Kenyan right now? C-51, Cabernet Town, and Marigot. So we're on the C-51 between Cabernet Town and Marigot. Let's try and remember that. Teachers College Baringo. N-H-I-F Cabernet. Serotonin. Baringo Cabernet. The, is that the Baringo National Reserve? No, the Bo Bogoria National Reserve. But there's a Baringo Conservation. Morup Tarambas County Government of Baringo. This is Kenya, right? It's got to be Kenya. The Kenyan flag doesn't look like that, though. Well, neither does the Ghanaian flag. Look at all the, the soil. Look at the soil. And the trees and the bushes. Just give me one thing with the country on it so I can confirm it and not feel like I'm going crazy. Like, I firmly in my heart believe this is Kenya, but I cannot prove it yet. Well, we're driving on the left. It can't be Ghana. All right, let's find Cabernet and Baringa. And if there's not, then we're in Uganda. So far, I don't see either of them, so that makes me really damn nervous that I'm completely off the base. Cabernet. Never mind. Forget you. Let's do this. Okay. So, Cabernet is here. It's probably also Cabernet. Where is Baringo? There's Marigot. We're between the two, right? Let's just backtrack a little bit here. On the C-51. All right. I didn't have to backtrack that far. Yeah, we're between Marigat to the east and Cabernet to the west on the C-51. There's the C-51. So you know, you know that there's going to be something that says this thing, right? The thing we're next to, which I already cannot remember the name of. But it's, oh, so what is this called? It's behind it. This Mart thing. Keda Mart Monument. Alright, so there's Cabaret. We're probably not in Cabaret. 
It's the Bringo County Assembly. Ketamart Monument Supermarket. Never mind, I lied. We're right here. Let's go. We're going to come in second on this thing, damn it. Because it, it, based on what's happening so far, I think Sagittarius is number one. Uh, happened to the 1070 in general, yeah. Solid state made a huge difference. I went solid state just recently. Oh my god, my computer literally boots up in about 20 seconds. And it used to be like four minutes. It's so much better. But the one thing to, to be aware of though, Nephew, if you're going to do the solid state, don't forget to get a non-solid state drive because streaming or recording with a solid state drive is really bad. So you need your temporary directory to be on not a solid state drive or it's so slow and there's a lot of loss. Building PCs is totally fun. These signs are placed. Somebody expected geoguessing. <laughs> yeah, you're kidding. You're not kidding. Oh, not the liquid cooler. When those go, that's bad. Nighty was number one. Oh, okay. Nighty does videos sometimes. I don't think he streams. You have both. That's the way to go. You got to do it. Because uh, that was part of my problem, too. Oh, and then Windows 10 is awful for for streaming. It's the worst. So, like, there are so many settings that you have to change to make it better. So, like, if you look, search for um, Optimize Windows Audio and Caden Live, K-T-E-N-L-I-V-E, -E, and they have a guide that is amazing. And it helps so much. It fixed almost all the problems. Now, there's some popping, but that's because I'm clipping. Because I get too excited. So, the Guerrero Ribeiro's Oh, my fucking God, we're in Brazil! Damn it. We're in Equatorial Brazil, though. That's very interesting. Oh, never mind. I'm sorry. We're in Switzerland. <laughs> My mistake. But it looks like we're in Equatorial Brazil. Hmm. I don't believe that, but... Top quiz. What if we're not in Brazil? But No, because that's way too high. It's got to be It's got to be Equatorial Brazil. Maybe we're in Belém. There is very little Street View coverage in Belém, but I think there is. Misericordia, unidad, cuidados, continuados, municipal, escola, IB 2.3, Roviar, Correos, Chile? No, that can't be right. That's the Portuguese flag. Are we in actual Portugal? Wait a minute. What island would be, what would be equatorial? Nothing would be equatorial. Look at the sun again. The sun's in the east, man. Well, the west at the moment. But, like... All right, you got me confused now. That's why we have five minutes. There's time to figure this out. That was definitely the Portuguese flag, though. Not the Brazilian flag, so... And these are EU plates. Oh, my God, we're in Europe somewhere. Portugal has holdings in Madeira. It has holdings in the Azores. It has holdings in Portugal. None of them are... are it's got to be because the sun is setting. That's the only thing I can think of. That's what's screwing up our... So we're in a Portuguese territory. Can we find a highway? That would be... I know that's, that's not correct, but I don't speak Portuguese. Brazil wouldn't get the bad camera? Really? That is definitely Austrian. You're in third. You dare me to... Okay, well, let's let's go now. We're actually in Portugal. I don't know what's going on with the sun, but so be it. Uh, the A1, the A17. Uh, I don't remember. The A1 is the E1, I'm pretty sure. But then where's the A17? Oh, that's the A11. Okay, so... Like I said, the A1 is the E1. So where's the 17? Oia e Viero el Puero Norte. C. Okay. Okay, alright, okay, 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 okay. So we are south of Oia e Viero and Ol Barrel Norte on the A117. A117 to combine? Do they, do they combine? Because if they do, we're gold. They do not. But this is an expressway, and there will be exit numbers. 
Oh, even better. There's a roundabout marking. Hey, 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 you. Don't do that. Go over here. Oh, never mind. Never mind. I can see it from here. Stop. Stop, stop, stop. The 235 IC2. So we're between Agueda and Bustos. 57 seconds. Jesus. Okay, we're between Agueda and Bustos and the N235. There's the N235. <laughs> oh, my God. I think we're here right now. Yeah, we are here right now. So the question is, how did we get here? I don't remember. Let's see if we can look, starting here, and figure it out. Uh, 40 seconds. Calm. All right, you're panicking. Don't panic. Grab your towel. Everything's fine. Biblioteco Municipal. We're at the library. Advogado. Antonio Advogado. The library. Um, the closest library would be... I think we're on this side, which is going to be wrong. I just, I can feel this is wrong. I'm going over here, which is also wrong. Everything's wrong. The whole world's on fire. Damn it. Damn it. Ugh, we were down in Overia de Bowel. We weren't going towards it. We were in it. I do not want summer. Summer can freaking die off the face of this planet. But spring would be nice. Do, do. Oh, somebody's no longer third. That's sad. Sad panda. The wrong pin more than round two screws you? Oh, man. Boop, be, do, 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 do. Boop, 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 boop. No, summer is. I'm not going to calm down about summer. Summer is evil. Unless it's Summer Glau, in which case she's an angel. But it, or Summer Bischel. She's like my one of my new celebrity crushes at the moment. She's just amazing. She's definitely my high king. Hello, what language are you? You are some sort of European language. Student Bond. Uh, it looks Dutch. This whole thing looks Dutch. Felgatan. Gotland's Hem. Yeah, it's some sort of Scandinavian something, maybe. Nordic something, I don't know. Spring and Autumns are the best. Boon Scrub Lord, what is up? How are you doing today? Hey, could any of my not mods <laughs> shout out Boon for me? Dutch has doubled rules. Sometimes. You have not streamed since Friday. How's the new masquerades that you're playing? About to eat some mini quiche? Dude, what? I ignored a pretty important sign? That's not unusual. I'll go back. Give it one more try. Which way did I go? Did I go down this way? I don't remember what I did. I think I went down this way. It's probably the Gotland's Hem thing, but I don't know what that means, right? So I didn't ignore it. I just don't know how to process it. Is it because we're on the island? Is that what you mean? What's the story of Gotland? It's like where the Norse gods supposedly touched down on Earth or something. Interesting story, very finicky mechanics, which means I probably would not like it. I like watching it, but I probably would it would drive me crazy playing it. It's a pretty important clue. The street marker. Nope, I completely missed the street marker. Mandy Muse. I don't know who that is. I can't pronounce your name, Hajj, so I'm just going to say Hajj, because there's a whole bunch of numbers after it, and that confuses me. So hopefully Hajj is okay. And welcome to the stream, by the way. Dude. Countries have those yellow signs. Sweden? Yeah, any Scandinavian country. I, I'm pretty sure we're on Gotland. The whole Gotland hem thing. But And I, I know I'm pronouncing that very, very British. Um, <laughs> you think hem is a city? Probably hem?
have Tim. I think we're on Gotland. Due to the snow. Oh, that makes sense. Haj is from Finland. Welcome. Is Hem an island? We're getting so close to wherever. The problem when I play okay, when I play diverse world is that like if I miss, like I just did. Perfect. I'm just like, ah, it's close enough. Visborg. Welcome in Visborg. Is Visborg a city? Visby is a city. I think the answer is no. Does Scotland have more than two? Two Scotland and Faro. Well, I guess there's these little do 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 do. Well, we should at least get some points, maybe. I can figure out the city by deduction. I think you might be overstating my powers of deduction. The problem is there's really only one big city on Gotland. I just don't remember what it's called. <laughs> so I'm kind of screwed. Oh, it's Visby. Visby is the one big city. Oh my god. How do you like that snipe? Just a half a second too late. I clicked on Visby as it hit zero. That's so that's so awful. <laughs> that's so awful. Nah. I'll take it though. I didn't deserve that 5,000 points. I did not deserve it. There's no way. I was eight. That don't tell you the caliber of players that are playing on the um, th this particular challenge. This is probably the best of the best of the GeoGuessr subreddit. And the GeoGuessr subreddit are probably some of the best GeoGuessr players in the world. And um, uh, 24881 is only good enough for eighth. It's mind-boggling. And this is only the second day. Like... There, th this, those. I, I won't be in the top ten by the end of this challenge. No way, no chance. Absolutely not. It was fun. I like playing it. That's actually better than I've done in a while, on the on the diverse world. So I appreciate that. And Mapper, of course, for putting that together. That is on the GeoGuessr subreddit. You can find that of course at com slash r slash GeoGuessr. And uh, for more action, of course, this is uh, not the end. If you're watching on Twitch, there is plenty of GeoGuessr action left to come, so stick around. If you're watching on YouTube, though, you will have to wait for tomorrow, at which time there will be a new episode. Thanks so much for watching this one. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. Subscribe to the channel to stay updated to everything that happens. And until next time, cheers.